Good morning, YouTube community. This is Ron coming to you from Grand Fox Playroom, and this is in response to Papa Dan's question, how do I display my built model? Um, this is a display case that I purchased um, many, many years ago, probably 35 years ago. From a store that was going out of business here in Broken Bow. And this was the first one to come in here. Uh, all the models in here are probably anywhere from 25 to 35 years old. Um, there is a couple new ones in there. I added the 55 Chevy and the 57 Chevy race cars. But everything else in there is super old. Um, don't know if we can see them or not. The airplanes down in the bottom shelf were four. Uh, not four. When I was hooked on the Black Sheep Squadron on TV. And I started building 148 scale World War II airplanes. Um, then we're going to try... Slide around here. Please excuse this very bad looking basement. Um, this is my trophy room. Looks right into the light. What a dummy. This is my trophy room. Um, display room. This is in the basement of my house. It's a big, big family room, and this is where all of Ron's toys and fun stuff is. Um, this is a little, another little display case that came out of a store. I don't even know what it was used for. This is my, probably my newest one. Um, and then there's a glass case on top. If I can get to it without too much problem with the hot rods in it, that is a glass display case. Two tier that I built when I was still working at the glass shop here in town. Um, I had several of them that way. And we'll go back up or at least make an attempt to and see what we can do. Um, the walls are covered with uh, my mementos, my Nostalgia, whatever you want to call it. We're going to try and get over into this corner and see if we can show you this case. Um, this came out of a filling station. It was a display. Uh-oh, white glass again. Um, it was a display for, I think, oil products, if I remember right. Um, and I don't know... We're going to try this and see what happens. Um, if I can get any closer without too much of a problem, I'm going to try and open the door and see if we can get rid of that glare. Oops. How come the door is not opening this morning? Huh. Too much. There we go. That will help a little bit, maybe. This is all of my past car builds from years past, um, except for the number 20 car, which is the one I just did for Smoke and Joe. Then we come down two more shelves. We have more NASCARs. The mirror probably behind is going to cause a problem, but we're going to try and do this anyway. Then we drop down another shelf, and I don't know if you can see them, because I can't. <laughs> These are my dirt track cars. Um, most of those in there are scratch built from the junk box. They're not out of kit. And then we'll back up just a little way, and we'll go down another shelf. And these are my World of Outlaws. Cars that I have built 
couple of years. I used to travel with a little of that lost circuit, and so I'm really hooked on the sprint cars. And then the very bottom shelf is just um, stuff that I have built, odds and ends, dragsters, um, old-style little race car there, that type of thing. Um, the dirt modified right there is all scratch built. Um, body was made out of just black sheet styling. Okay, now we're going to come back up and we're going to try and back out of this corner. My basement is a total mess because it's my toys and then it is storage. Yeah, don't know if people know about storage or not. If we can, we're going to back around and go to one more. We'll just kind of do a real quick, I'll try to do a quick swing around here without getting you too seasick. Uh, all the shelving and stuff that the die cast and that on, uh, glass shelving that I built when I was working at the glass shop. Um, and then my other display case in here is an old, um, old, old bookcase. That's what it was, with sliding doors on it. And this has a lot of the hot rods in it. And sitting on top of this, I can get a halfway decent view of it, is a long glass case that I built that has all my mercuries, or 50 mercuries that I had built, and 249 ports. Um, we are getting close to our nine minutes, so we're going to shut this off, and we're going to call this part one, and then we will Watch it and see if it's worth a hoot. This is in response to Papa Dan's question about how I display my built models. So, thank you, Papa Dan. We're going to shut this down, and we're going to go watch it and see if we got to do it all over again. Everybody have a great weekend.